Here's how to use your MetaQuest as an HDMI display. So the first thing you're gonna need to do for this tutorial to work is you're gonna need to get some kind of HDMI capture card. This one right here is called the WarKey capture card and it is built specifically for iPads and the MetaQuest. And I really like this one in particular because on the side here, guys, there's this little USB-C port that allows you to charge and use this capture card at the same time. They were nice enough to send this one to me, so if you wanna go and check it out, guys, the link is in my description with a little code to give you an extra percentage off of your purchase if you wanna use this one. But anyway, first and foremost, you're gonna need one of these. And once you get this thing, you're gonna to wanna to plug it into your headset. Once you have this cable plugged into your headset, the next thing you gotta do is plug the HDMI cord into the other end of the capture card. And from here, everything else is gonna happen in the headset. Once you are inside of the headset, you're going to want to go to the Meta Horizon store and you're going to go into the search tab and you're going to search for HDMI, okay? HDMI, and then hit go, okay? And once you search for that, this first thing should come up right here, the MetaQuest HDMI link. You're going to want to get that and install it on your headset. Once it's all installed, guys, hit start. And because your headset is all plugged in, you should see a screen that pops up like this, okay? It'll ask you for some settings and whatnot. If you don't see the screen, guys, quit out of the application, unplug the cord and plug it back in. That fixed it for me, guys. But you should get something like this, guys. And then you just got to hit start streaming to start seeing the HDMI input in your device. So yeah, once you hit start streaming, it should pull up your HDMI input. So I have this connected to my Switch right now. You can connect this to your PlayStation, your Xbox, anything with an HDMI cord, guys. You can see this. And as you can see, guys, it's pretty responsive. 60 frames per second at 4K resolution. It's a ton of fun. I've been playing Super Smash Bros. in my headset with it, which has been a blast. But anyway, guys, that's how you do it. That's how you can use your headset to see any HDMI input. And it is freaking awesome. If something didn't work for you or you have any questions about this tutorial, guys, please leave those down in the comments below. I'll do my best to help where I can. But thank you so much for watching and let me know what tutorial you need next.